One of the other very common problems that you'll probably want to fix in some of your photos are these, uh, you see these occasionally, people where you see the red eyes. And this is, uh, of course, you probably know, an indication that this person is a vampire. Um, but we don't necessarily want all of our friends to know which of our mutual friends are vampires. And so we generally want to hide those red eyes and fix them. Fortunately, in iPhoto, it's got the unvampire button, the fix red eye button. And li literally just click it once and boom, magically fixes those red eyes. And that's really nice and easy. Um, you, you can also do a little bit more manual control. First of all, once you've set the red eyes, if, if auto fix is on, it's going to automatically identify pupils and make them uh, and take take them from red and turn them black. You can also manually add uh, black dots if you need to. So, if for example, there is a uh, let's make the size really small, and I could click and add a little a little bit bigger, so you can see it here. Click and add a black dot on the picture to create uh, to, to cover up an eye I can make that dot bigger if we were it was a bigger close-up and we needed a big picture you know cover somebody's eye now I've given this guy such terrible diseases uh, let's go ahead and, and undo and we can undo individually each of those clicks um, and go back and just in this case leave the auto fix red eye on but again so if you want to manually add a, uh, a black dot on top of an eye just the size slider and then go ahead and click on the picture where you want that black eye to be. And uh, you see, notice it only works on skin tone. It doesn't do anything on the gray of the sweatshirt or the white of the wall. The hair is close enough to skin tone that it works there. But so it tries to limit where it'll allow you to do this to not make a bunch of mistakes. But uh, let's undo those last couple clicks there. And now we've got our corrected picture. Of course, I can't do anything about that. My vampire friend has his mouth open. That was just a, a bad time to click the picture. But there you go.